afternoon. It is approximately, um, it's close to 5 p.m. on Wednesday, October 9th, 2013, here in Seattle, Washington. <laughs> Still, um, I am coming into the flow of um, less privacy. It's really all it boils down to. Um, more people to take into consideration with regards to my day-to-day -day living um, and the sharing of a relatively small space um, as compared to what I've been um, living in in Florida. So I am still physically sort of feeling that um, and adjusting to a little bit more of a constricted space and trying not to let my demeanor be uh, as affected as it already has been. However, today I sort of um, began to embrace that slowing down, quieting down that this is required of me. And um, in my constant state of calculating still, I had to wonder if um, that perhaps was part of what this trip is really, is really for. Um, it sort of hit me that, oh man, um, okay, I don't, I don't, I don't want to put too much pressure on myself. There are so many things that I felt within the past few hours were of tremendous value to try to get on tape. But I don't want to try to get them all out at once. I don't want to prematurely cut them off and head off on another tangent. here in my home for the first time in a way that I never was before simply because of how much I've shifted in the past nine months since I was last here and um, I gotta tell you I mean, just already, 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 this trip has been so incredible. The interaction with the cousin with whom I live is probably a lot more of what I think both of us envisioned when we first moved in together. I can say that I just didn't know where the heck I was, man. I knew I was just coming into Seattle flying high, never, ever feeling as happy as I, as I did, and just knowing for the first time in my life that I could just be for a little bit and not have to be so concerned about what's next, what's next, what's next. I have learned so much about myself in the past two years since arriving here, two and a half years. And um, I know there is still so much more to uncover in terms of the woman I want to be today. The woman I want to be today there are still parts of my old story that are still not allowing me to engage in living patterns that are aligned with what I claim I want and believe. 
for myself, for my life. And I will know, I will know when that alignment comes. Because that is when I will be sustaining myself with my work to the extent that it allows me to move back here to Seattle and create a living and working environment similar to what I have in Sarasota. 